A local auto dealer is fighting back against Chevrolet's plans to drop them, but they think their dealership was targeted. And the internet is a great tool, but many don't realize just how much of your personal information is online and up for sale. How to protect yourself? A cold one tonight, freeze warnings, frost advisories, weather where you live, coming up tonight at 10. Now on Fox 23 News at 10. What local restaurants will be posting calorie content on their menus? A local community gets a double blow how the car dealers plan to fight to stay alive. And a surprise for the hill towns. If you felt your house shake last night, you were not alone. We'll tell you why. The 10 o'clock news. Fox 23 News at 10 starts right now. Get ready to calorie count. It may soon get a little bit easier in New York State. Good evening to you. I'm John Gray. And I'm Ann Hughes. First on Fox Today, Governor David Patterson submitted legislation that would require certain restaurants in New York State to post calorie content on their menus. It's all in an effort to make New Yorkers healthier and to combat obesity. The measure is already in place in New York City, and now the governor wants to expand the calorie posting practice to restaurants in the rest of the state. Fox 23's Katherine Hauser is live in Colony now to tell us what restaurant menus will be affected. Katherine? Hey there, Ann. Well, this bill will affect chain restaurants like Moe's here in Colony. Now, the owner tells me tonight that he thinks putting calorie content on the menus is a good idea. Gregory Yamin is the owner of two Moe's restaurants in Albany. Welcome to Moe's. Welcome to Moe's. He knows the formula to making a great burrito. And when it comes to Governor Patterson's latest push to post calorie content on menus, Yamin says he's all for it.